Well, welcome back, everyone. My name is Colonel 6 back with more of this preposterous game. We are now on day five, and for any of you who are Sierra fans, you know, if it's not the last day, we're getting close to the last day when you get to day five. Daily mirror check. Whoa! Okay, that was good. Let's do it again. Okay. That's fine. You look in the drawer, nothing there. Nothing except the Gideon butt. <gasps> There's finally something there! Woo! My wallet. Ironically enough, I forgot my wallet when I went to work today. I guess that's where it went. <laughs> wow, that's kind of a dick move of a puzzle. <laughs> you get all the way to work and then you can't do anything because you forgot your wallet. <laughs> that's funny. Man in blab. Who's my special girl? <laughs> you know, you never guess what I thought I saw, Blob. You know, for a second there, I thought you were the Jurassic rat. <laughs> I love you, Blob. And no matter what, I'll make sure someone takes good care of you. Oh, don't say that. That's not cool. Can I make an appointment? Nope. Oh, she's a psychiatrist, not a psychologist. Okay, now I understand why she's not really that good at talk therapy. No offense to you psychiatrists out there, but different training. I'm sorry. Is the truth. Mail time! No nope. mail. No mail. You're usually here by now. Ask him you shall receive, buddy. Take my call. Nope. Don't mind. That's the threshold project symbol. <laughs> Fuck you, piece of paper. say so. Okay, I can't leave. Once again, this seems a problem. I just tried to do that ten seconds ago and it wouldn't do it. Gah! I have, I have to see Dr. Harburg right away. I'm, I'm, I'm having uh, problems, and I, uh... Um, yes, sir. I'll get it right away. Please hold. That's not how that works. This is Dr. Harburg. Doc, this is Curtis. Um, I'm, 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 ha I'm having troubles. I need to see you. I, it's Therese. She, um, she's been murdered, and I... Oh God! Don't don't tell Doctor Merrick. He's he's in on it. I mean, they're all in on it. And and I, oh God, Doc, I have to see you. I have to see you now. It'll be all right, Curtis. Come on over, okay? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Calling the police. No, really, you should. What can I do for you, Doctor Ricky? Trisha, 
Could you alert security? One of my patients is on his way over, and I believe he's in the middle of a psychotic episode. But please, don't have him intercepted. Just ask security to be ready if I call, all right? Will do, doctor. Wait a second. What's going on? Also, why is your phone 80 years old? Oh, snap! They bugged it! That's going to be the stinger. <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> You're not paranoid if they really are out to get you. He's mine! Dr. Harburg? What in the fuck was that? Uh-oh. Uh, how about we save? Yeah, I think saving right- What is that on the wall? Okay, save- saving is yes. Saving is very much yes. I have a feeling I could die here if I'd make a wrong move. I don't think he can oh see it, Curtis. Boy. You haven't even seen that there's a body. <laughs> don't you love how these security guards are always like 60 years old plus? Uh, now would be a good time to do something, but I'm probably gonna die, but hey, let's do it anyway. And dead. Jesus, they give a security guard a Colt revolver? <laughs> I could have sworn that the game kind of teased you with uh, mocking messages when you die like that. Alright, so the last time I tried this, it crashed, so let me do try again. Uh... uh. Okay, so I'm gonna have to skip forward a little bit. Hey! Hey! Ew! Jesus, Doc! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, Doc! That's great. Oh, I could use a malted f- Well, Curtis, whether you did it or not, you got the doctor killed, one way or another. What the hell was that? Sorry, I'm going kind of quick. I just want to get past this and get to the- the end of this glorious experience. Okay, nothing here. Time to go to work. I haven't been in here in a while. Oh! Cutscene.
Trevor, don't do that. Trevor, you scared the crap out of me. I Curtis, listen, you... listen, listen. I've been delving deep into the company network. Just leave it alone, man. It's bad. I can't, Trevor. I can't let it go. You, you, you don't get it, Curtis. I gave myself top clearance. I saw. I've been synthesizing illegal drugs. Curtis, we've killed before. Oh, my God. I'm going to the cops. No job is worth this. But Curtis, I want you to stay out of it. I don't want you to get hurt. I love you, bro. Is he gonna kiss him? No. Oh no. That's not good. I know that music. Not you, Trev! Curtis Craig, you kill everything you touch. No! Thanks, Dubbing. With the loss of his true love, Curtis Craig killed himself. I guess I have to take the top clearance card, don't I? Nope, nope, no. Oh, don't cry, Curtis. The scene again. With his collar starched. And wax in his nose and his jaws wired shut. This is getting serious. Good night, sweet sassy gay prince. Oh, cop lady, I'm back. Let's have a refreshing drink of water. <laughs> Is that a Metroid? Curtis, we need to talk about adjusting your meds. Because, whoa. I know I clicked on that and nothing happened. <laughs> God, is everybody's cubicle cleared now? Everybody's dead. Except Jocelyn. Oh! oh! Cop lady! Nope, nothing there. 
Really nothing there, is there? It's all a figment of your imagination. I like how this is the only undisturbed cubicle. Let's go to work. Please tell me I don't have to do anything more here. Although I guess I should check my email just for grins. What happens if I call the numbers on day five? <laughs> Trevor Barnes, I'm dead. Me, you're gonna be dead. Jocelyn, I'm not dead. Tom, I'm dead. Trees, I'm dead too. Bob, you killed me. I don't know, Curtis. Carpe diem. <laughs> we cock and knock be completed as dialed. <laughs> Can I do any of these? Is there any point to this? No, don't show that to me again. Gonna get some work done, even though everybody's dead. Oh, God. Subtlety was never a part of the Phantasmagoria series. Hi! What do you want from me? I only want you to be happy, Curtis. You've nearly lost your mind, haven't you? This new version of the After Dark screensaver is weird. Get away from me! Get away from me, Satan! Who are you? Don't you recognize me, Curtis? I'm just a part of your own twisted mind. If you'll just give in to me, let me take over, you'll be so much happier. It won't hurt. What? <laughs> no! I'm sorry, I just, I can't take him seriously when he gets angry and fierce. <laughs> well, that was fun. In the fight for his life, Curtis Craig placed third. It's a beating heart. You could tell because there was no lead up music that gives away everything. I bet those weird messages are going to be popping up all over the place. Yep, killed them all. Very good. I don't think I need to do any of this, but I might want to check my uh, email just for fun. <laughs> to Curtis Craig, from Curtis Craig, regarding health concerns. Dear Curtis, I really think we should check ourselves into the hospital right now. That nice Dr. Merrick will take care of everything. We won't have to think, we won't have to feel. All we'll have to do is relax and ride the Thorazine. If we take enough, we won't even feel the scalpels or the shocks. He promised not to make it hurt that much. I trust him, don't you? Hurry, Curtis, before we kill someone else. Your friend, Curtis Craig. Can I reply to that? No, I can't. <laughs> we'll be together again soon, my love, my monster, my baby son. Soon we'll be together forever, and then I can kill you, you murdering thick! I'll rip out your black twisted heart soon, soon, soon! To Curtis Cra Yeah, that one might be real. Forget when tech could get out of here now. <laughs> Why did you kill me, you son of a whore? <laughs>
Okay, I've already read that. That was pretty funny. Why did you kill me, you son of a whore? All right, fun's fun, but we got to get down to business here. I've noticed the crashes are starting to become more frequent, so I'd like to save a little bit more frequently as well. 